Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I made my YouTube channel banner. This is what my YouTube channel banner looks like on the YouTube desktop version. And this is what my banner looks like on the mobile version. To make the channel banner, we're going to be using the desktop version of Google Slides. And we're also going to be using the mobile apps, Pixar and Fonto. And all of these apps are completely free on the App Store. We're also going to be uploading the channel banner from the desktop version of YouTube. To get to your channel banner, press the blue button that says Customize Channel, and then click Branding at the top. And here you can change your channel banner under where it says Banner Image. To make the channel banner, the first thing we're going to do is open a new presentation in Google Slides. Then on a blank slide, change the background color to the color of your choice that matches the color scheme of your YouTube channel. Also, if you're wondering how I just took that screenshot, hold Command Shift 4 on the keyboard to take a screenshot on a Mac. I'm going to be using a light blue background because my channel color scheme is light blue, light pink, and light yellow. I use these colors in my thumbnails, profile picture, and channel banner. Next, I'm typing YouTube channel banner dimensions into Google. I'm going to use this image and overlay it over my slide to make sure I'm placing my channel banner images into the right places so that they will appear correctly on my channel banner when viewed on the desktop and mobile version of YouTube. Now I'm finding a light blue Instagram logo and a Twitter logo on Google Images. To get rid of the white background on the Instagram logo, I'm moving the Instagram logo from my downloads folder to my desktop, double clicking it. And to get rid of the white background, I'm pressing the icon at the top right that looks like a marker. And then I'm pressing the icon at the top left that looks like a magic wand. Then I'm dragging over the white background with the magic wand, pressing delete, then holding command A to select all and command C to copy. Now back on the Google slide, I'm pressing Command V to paste the Instagram logo onto the slide. Now I'm going to search for a pink subscribe button logo in Google Images. I'm saving it to my desktop. Opening it and using the same process to get rid of the white background by pressing the marker and then the magic wand. I'm dragging over the white background, deleting it, selecting all with command A, copying with command C, and pasting the logo into Google Slides with command V.
Now I'm going to find two pictures of myself on my phone and airdrop them to my laptop to use them in the channel bin. After airdropping the photos, they should appear in your downloads folder. Open them up and then using the marker tool and the magic wand tool, drag over the backgrounds of the pictures to delete the background until you have just a cutout of yourself in the picture. Once you have the cutout images, hold Command A, Command C, and then Command V in the Google slide. Now all we need is the text for the channel banner. On mine, I wrote the name of my YouTube channel and a short description of the types of videos I make on my channel. For this part, we're going to need two apps. One will be PixArt and the other will be Fonto. First, I'm opening PixArt and scrolling all the way down to the bottom to where it says Color Backgrounds. Then I'm clicking the first option, which is a PNG image. It should look like a white and gray checkerboard. Then I'm tapping next in the top right hand corner and then tapping the light green save to photos button. Now I'm opening Fonto and then I'm pressing the camera icon at the bottom, pressing photo albums, and then selecting the PNG that I just saved from Pixar. Now when I tap the PNG, it should say add text. Then I'm tapping add text writing my YouTube channel name, and choosing the font I want to use. I would also suggest using a font that you usually use in your YouTube thumbnails to make your channel more cohesive. Next, I'm changing the text color, the background color, and the outline color of the words. To change the text color, make sure you're on the option that says text. To change the outline color, make sure you're on the option that says stroke. And to change the background color, change where it says color at the top of the screen to style. And then you'll be able to change the background drop shadow color of the words. Once you're finished, tap the icon in the bottom right hand corner of the screen and save as PNG and make sure that you press save as PNG, not save as image. Now I'm just doing the exact same process for my channel description, saving that text as a PNG. And now the two PNGs of the text should be in your photos on your iPhone.
Now airdrop the two PNGs to your laptop and they should appear in your downloads folder. Then open both of them up and press Command A to select. Command C to copy and go to your Google slide once again and press Command V to paste. Once you position everything into the proper places, delete the dimensions guide, and now we're all finished making the YouTube channel banner. Now the only thing left to do is upload the banner to our YouTube channel. I've noticed that if I screenshot the channel banner from the Google slide, the channel banner appears blurry once it's in YouTube. To prevent this from happening, press File, Download, and then Save as PDF. Then open the PDF version of the channel banner and screenshot the PDF version. This will make sure that the channel banner is as clear as possible once we upload it to YouTube. On this screen, it says to make your channel banner at least 2048 by 1152 pixels, but we're actually going to want to make the channel banner 2560 by 1440 pixels for better results. So we're going to go to the screenshot of the PDF, and at the top of the screen, click Tools, then click Adjust Size. Then where it says Width, type 2560, and where it says Height, make sure it's around 1440. Then press save, and in YouTube, press change, and select your channel banner, and then hit done. It might take a few minutes for your channel banner to update on the mobile version, but once it updates, your banner will appear on YouTube mobile as well. For more YouTube tutorials, Make sure to check out my YouTube tips and tricks playlist for more videos on how to make thumbnails and how to make your own YouTube channel intro for free using only your iPhone. I will link those videos in the description box down below as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and make sure to like this video if you found it helpful. Also make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!